Hey guys, this is Nick and John from Novation, and we're here to talk about the Circuit version 1.2 release. It's an amazing update and we're very excited to bring it to you because we've been working very hard at Novation and also externally within the community to develop Circuit as an amazing platform to both write and perform music on. This is the first of many updates to come, but there's some amazing features in this one, so we'd love to tell you all about it. One of the cool new features is the ability to record MIDI into Circuit Sequencer using an external MIDI controller. So you've always been able to play the internal synths using a MIDI keyboard, but now you can record into the sequencer like this. Another great use of this feature is to use an external MIDI controller to control the internal parameters of circuit. In this case, we're using the Launch Control XL on page one set up as a mixer, which gives us control over level for each of the channels, as well as a dedicated send to the delay and reverb. On the second page, we've set it up to give us control over the macros for the synths, which allow us to control both synths at the same time. We also have assigned two controls to the global filter, which gives us access to both the filter frequency and resonance. Another great feature that we've added is momentary record. Record previously was toggled on or off, but now you can capture your performances simply by holding record down. So now let's look at per step automation clear. We've always had per step automation and what that is is when you have the sequencer stopped but record armed. And this allows you to select any step and adjust a parameter for just that step. We've now added per step automation clear, which quite simply when you have the sequencer stopped and record armed, you can hold down clear and you just twist the knob to clear that step. We've also added the ability to change patches via program change. This is really handy if you're using your keyboard because you can just scroll through your patches, but you can also automate the process from inside your door. So the most exciting thing about the latest update is the ability to import your own samples into Circuit. Yeah, this is a really amazing feature. So we're gonna cover this in depth in its own tutorial video. So just follow the link. Thanks for watching.